This is a five minute guide of the use of a toaster teleporter to access the toaster mill brewery. Begins by clicking on the logo to enter the toaster teleporter home base and click on the toaster mill brewery icon. You can navigate through this tour by holding the left mouse button down and rotating round. I've selected the aerial video icon which is a drone and it loads up a video of an aerial video of the toaster mill brewery. Now clicking on the ground floor icon takes us to the outside of the toaster mill brewery and I'm going to click on to the tap room and it will take me into the tap room bar. Holding the left mouse button down will allow me to rotate and see various hotspots to different parts of the tap room bar. I'm going to rotate it all the way around to show you all of the hotspots and it includes a hotspot take to take you back outside. What I'm going to do is click on the snug hotspot which takes me into the ground floor corridor. Clicking again on the snug will take me inside the snug where we can see that wonderful railway station sign from the old Tosa railway station. Clicking on this hotspot shows me a different view of the snug and holding the left mouse button down allows me to go back and click on an icon to the tap room which takes me outside the tap room. I'm now going to go up the stairs to the ground from the ground floor to the first floor. Now I'm on the first floor landing and I rotate round and again we're going to go all the way round so that we can see uh, entrance to the toilets, back down to the ground floor, access to the first floor and now I'm going to go into the turbine room. A turbine room is a function room and this is in the doorway to the turbine room so I click on the entertainment icon and I can see the inside of the turbine room Let's rotate round we're going to be going in a moment to the first floor landing uh, but the first floor landing before we do that we're going to the entertainment area and behind the door which is not open to the general public we can see a little picture of the original mill gears going on to the first floor landing we can see we can go back into the turbine room or climb up the stairs up the first floor stairs to the second floor landing which will provide us with a hot spot that will take us into the malt room a malt room has got two large rooms with the stage area where entertainments frequently held and we can click on another hotspot which will take us into a bar area you see we've got a bar rotating round it's got quite a sizable meeting room area with a large screen for any functions we're now going to go back though to the stage area which takes us back into that part of the malt room and from there we're going to go back onto the second floor landing which will give us access, so it's actually a private access we're going to go up to the roof which is access from the third floor once on the roof area there are a number of hot spots which will give us different views from different directions we can go back to the original aerial view look at an aerial video or go back downstairs to the ground floor entrance once we're outside now going to take you into the brewery part of it uh, the brewery entrance is for stuff only we're going to have a little peek inside and we can see the vats we click on the hot spots looking at the inside of the microbrewery we can look round in the virtual tour we're going to click on the way out and that will take us back 
to the original brewer review we click on the step outside hotspot which will take us back into the corridor and once in the corridor we can rotate round and click on the fire exit which will take us out back outside again so this is a very brief video